Gwyneth Paltrow, 50, has denied in court that she had been engaging in risky behavior leading up to a ski collision she was involved in at a Utah ski resort in 2016. At the time, Gwyneth was skiing with her two children, Moses, 16, and Apple, 18, whom she shares with ex-husband, Coldplay frontman Chris Martin. She told the court, I was not engaging in any risky behavior. I would not engage in risky behavior with or without my children being there, the Hollywood star said. I have always been open and honest with my kids, and they know me very well. Terry Sanderson, the retired optometrist who is suing the Goop founder, has claimed Gwyneth's reckless actions on the slope left him with broken ribs, brain damage and lasting physical injuries. The Sliding Doors star testified that the crash had left her in shock, and she absolutely froze in the direct aftermath. The Hollywood actress also claimed to the court that at one point, she worried that she was being violated. She said, two skis came between my skis, forcing my legs apart. And there was a body pressing against me and a very strange grunting noise. My brain was trying to make sense of what was happening, she recalled while discussing the collision. Gwyneth reiterated her claim that she had been skied into from behind by Mr. Sanderson. The actress explained, My daughter was down the hill, my son was to my left, so I was skiing and my eyes were not fixated on my son when Mr. Sanderson skied directly into my back. I was confused at first and I didn't know exactly what was happening. Don't miss. Rio Ferdinand claims has never seen Victoria Beckham eat, comment, Gwyneth Paltrow case as court hears accuser said he was famous, latest, Snoop Dogg will perform at King Charles coronation on one condition, exclusive, it's a very strange thing to happen on a ski slope. I froze and I would say I got very upset a couple of seconds later. During her deposition, Gwyneth recalled that she and Mr. Sanderson had come crashing down together during the incident and their bodies were almost spooning. She also said several times she had been the victim of the ski crash while giving evidence in a U.S. trial, in which she is countersuing Mr. Sanderson. Gwyneth added, what you have to remember is that when you're a victim of a crash, your psychology is not necessarily thinking about the person who perpetrated it. Mr. Sanderson hit me and that is categorically the truth.